Hey trendsetters, Tim here from Huntsman Brewing. Now, I received this package in the mail today. Beer mail, the best type of mail there is. Uh, from Chris, good old Gibbo down there in Taranaki for the uh, No Quarter Brewing. And um, I'm expecting a couple of little surprises in here. I've been looking forward to opening this all day. Buddy tapping the kitchen shit itself, and I had to put a new tap in. And it cut right into my beer mail time. Anyway, let's uh, try not to cut my finger here and see what we got. Some bloody good packaging. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my goodness. Well, this is a pleasant surprise. Now, New Zealand, if anyone doesn't know that I'm Australian, I'm married to Kiwi, I live in New Zealand, I work in Australia, so I'm, I'm back and forth a fair bit. I've travelled probably more than most punters, and, um, you know, all over the world, I've tasted different beers, but New Zealand has to have some of the best beers I've ever tasted. Um, they're up there, world class, um, you know, Deep Creek, 8 Wide, Garage Project, Panhead, I mean, there's more, the list could just go on. Rocky Knob, um, some great beers. Now Chris has sent me one of New Zealand's finest, and if you haven't been to New Zealand or had never had a chance to taste this, um, you're missing out. I just want to say thank you very much because it's not every day you get a double brown can in the beer mail. What a bloody top vibe. Good on you, Bubo. I owe you, I owe you big time. Thank you very much. That's going straight in the fridge, straight to the pool room. Um, uh oh, what have we got here? Oh my goodness! Probably the last one in history, Misty Mountain Hops. Now I'm definitely privileged to be um to be a holder of this. This is going to be uh straight to the pool fridge as well. So, cheers, mate. Um, I might have been taking the piss a bit about the double brown, but this one goes in the same category. This is just absolutely sensa sensational, world class, great beer, and um, yeah, this is going to be savoured over a. Um, um, I, I might share it with Russell because uh, we both love this beer, and um, yeah, it's a bloody job well done. And wait for it. You can see that a Pinot Barrel aged Belgian quad, and you can read that right. That's thirteen and a half percent. I probably won't be tucking into that tonight, but um, I'll definitely uh, be looking forward to this. And um, yeah, I'll put I'll put out a review as well because um, I know this is going to be sensational. And um, you never know, I could have a big night. Bang this four percenter in to start with. Hit the misty and then straight in the barrel quad. Anyway, Gibbo, appreciate it, mate. Thank you very much. And um, for those of you that are outside New Zealand, um, I'd uh, highly recommend if you ever see this anywhere, um, you grab a hold of it, put it on ice, and um, chug it down on a hot day to cool you, quench your thirst. So, cheers, mate. Um, appreciate it. Thank you.